see. Sir fix -a -Lot over here has a good track record with this kind of thing. Well, I'm useless. But it looks like that won't matter with all you capable people around. Fantastic. Don't put yourself down, Adia. You're great, too. Thanks for your encouragement. Anyway, for the time being, please talk amongst yourselves. That'll give me some time to think things through and maybe make a start on, um, delegating. Hi, Miss General. Mr. Honorary Knight says that you're from Watatsumi Island. What's it like there? There must be loads of fish, right? Wait! You look kind of like a mermaid. Are there fish in your family? Oh, <laughs> sorry to disappoint you, Miss Mage, but I'm just an ordinary human. I have lots of great stories about Watatsumi Island, though. Come on, let's enjoy the scenery while I tell you all about it. Feeling nervous, Kale? Well, it's your first time as a guide, after all. Hmm? Oh, no. <laughs> Not at all. I'm just, uh, still settling into the role. So I was thinking about how to talk more like Master Chinari. Well, the easiest way to imitate someone is to start with their most common turns of phrase. Oh, okay. In that case, uh, <clears throat> put that mushroom down. Huh. <sighs> Now! It's highly poisonous! There you go. With just a few simple words, you've captured your master's personality perfectly. Anyway, what about your role? Don't you mind being the master thief? It doesn't sound like you're one of the good guys. <laughs> Maybe not. Until you factor in that I only steal from the enemy. I think that's enough to make me one of the good guys, don't you? Uh, fair point, fair point. <sighs> huh? Who else has visited the Valoria Mirage recently? Uh, there was someone from the Academia who came not long ago. A Kasharawar scholar. Blonde hair. Architect, I think. He was a huge help, and redesigned many of the buildings here. Although he was always grumbling to himself, he was extremely diligent in his work. Ah, oh, what a kind person. I could tell that was a sensitive soul. A lot like me. Uh, sorry, please pretend you didn't hear that. <clears throat> I'm of course a very strong and resilient person. After him, an aristocrat from Mondstadt showed up, then the gen... I mean, Miss Sangonomia. Unfortunately, everything here suddenly started changing before I had the chance to be a good host and show them around. Do you know where the Mondstadt aristocrat is now? If I remember correctly, he headed north after the incident. It's a pity we're having all these issues. Hmm... <sighs> If we could get everything working normally again, I could probably locate him in an instant. Still, not to worry. There's nothing dangerous here. Hmm. Hey, Idea! You got an update for us? We've all caught up with each other. Very well. Then please allow me, Idea, your mascot, to explain exactly what's happened here.
basically, this entire domain is powered by a device called the Central Hub, which you all saw earlier. But following a major incident, several key components from the Central Hub came loose and went flying. Four components, I believe, which has caused the Central Hub to stop turning. Oh, so that thing's supposed to spin? Yes, it definitely shouldn't be frozen still like it is now. At least, that's not how it was when I first got here. Oh, I've done such a terrible job of taking care of it, it's so embarrassing! Hey, everything's gonna be okay. Hmm. So, we need to fix the big wheel up there, and to do that, we need to find the missing parts. Right. I do know where one of the parts is. It landed not too far away. But the rest all landed in different areas. I'm afraid you'll have to go and look for those. <clears throat> now, as the caretaker and your mascot, I shall announce your respective adventure duties. Um, you can just be yourself if you want. No need to force the whole role-playing thing. <laughs> oh, I see. Um, okay, so I was thinking that maybe Swordmaster Eula and Healer Kale could investigate the Northern Zone, if that's okay? Fine by me. I was going to be looking for my cousin there anyway. I'll be your backup, Eula. I know you usually team up with Amber, so I'll try my best to fill her shoes. Oh? Well, this'll be fun. Let's see if a forest ranger can outperform an outrider. Master Thief Kaya and Mage Klee, if you could earmark some time in your busy schedules to search the West Zone. Earmark? What does that mean? It just means we mustn't forget to do it. Don't worry. We can handle that. Finally, we have our General, Miss Sangonomiya, and our Knight, the Traveler. If there's no objections, please come with me to retrieve the first component. Wow! Spoken like a true knight! <laughs> then, for my part, my strategic mind is at your service. Alright, well, if anyone finds anything, come back here and we'll regroup. Please take care while you're out on the road and look after each other, especially our little mage here. You got it! I'll take extra special care of Kaya. I'll be on my best behavior. Uh... <laughs> okay, we'll leave it there for now. You two, please follow me. I remember seeing it just behind the central hub. So, how come you didn't bring it back when you first saw it? I'd have been more than happy to, if this one component was enough to fix the whole domain. But with three other components to find... Oh, I suddenly felt overwhelmed by how much work needed doing. Hmm, Paimon kind of gets that. Taking the first step is always the hardest part.
Kan and Watatsumi Island for now. So I thought I'd take the chance to get out and see more of the world. You've traveled a pretty long way. Why Sumeru? I figured that I needed to venture further than usual to really broaden my horizons. Well, that's one reason, anyway. I can explain in more detail another time. Barbara, go! Okay, this is the spot. Now, I'm sure you're both wondering, oh, but where's the component? There is nothing here. Oh, where could it be? Oh, it's that lamp thingy, right? Water droplet showed us how that works already. Uh, yes, ugh, that's the one. There goes my big introduction. Showing people the ropes is supposed to be my job. Oh, I can't believe I'm being shown up by a Hydro Eidolon. Cheer up, Idea. The Hydro Eidolon can give a basic demonstration of how to use things, but beyond that, it can't communicate. That's where you come in. Your descriptions can explain everything in full, vivid detail. Paimon forgot how persuasive Kokomi can be when she really wants to. Hmm. Sometimes having a genius strategist around really comes in handy. Oh, well, if you put it that way... <laughs> well then, just pretend like you've never seen it before, and I'll tell you all about it. This is called the Streaming Projector. Everything here in the Valurium Mirage was made using this device. All you need to do is place an item in the projector, and you can construct a corresponding item based on the shape of the original and your imagination. At least, I think that's what it used to do. With the domain in its current state, only its most basic functions are still operable. Okay, not quite that basic. At the moment, it's only able to show two-dimensional objects. I call them preprints. <laughs> Think of it 
like a sort of draft or blueprint or something. So you're saying the component fell into the preprint? Yes, exactly. I'll leave you to go in and physically retrieve it. Well, I, um, I'll be out here rooting for you by, uh, by doing a motivational dance! Really? No, sorry. I feel like I have two left feet when I try to dance. I guess I'll just find a place nearby to sit and wait patiently for you. <laughs> <laughs>